Is knowing HTML and CSS enough to land you a job as a front-end developer? Short answer, no. Long answer, no, but that doesn't mean that you can't still make money off of those skills. Let's talk about it. Hey, I'm Bree. I'm a software engineer and your tech bestie who is here to guide and motivate you along your journey into tech. Believe it or not, this is a very common question that I get. Some developers want to know when they can start making money on their new skills. Learning to code is an investment. It's not a quick thing to do. So at the very least, it's an investment of your time. But for most people who purchase at least a few different courses or may even attend a coding bootcamp or a college, it can be a large monetary investment as well. So it's totally not crazy to wanna to know when you can start monetizing these new skills. For web developers, if your goal is to get a job with like a company or an organization, I would not jump head first into the job pool only knowing HTML and CSS. So let's talk about why, but let's also talk about a few different ways that you can monetize those skills along your journey. So I alluded to it before, but knowing HTML and CSS will not be enough to land you a role in today's job market. They are great starting skills for web development, and it's very likely that 10 years ago, they would have been enough to get your foot in the door. And in fact, I know that that's how some people were able to get their foot in the door. So why is it not the case anymore? We're no longer in a time and place where the web is built on read-only websites. Most things that you interact with today on the web are dynamic and progressive web apps. There aren't too many websites that I can think of or that I use daily that don't reach out to some version of an API to return some information. This means in order to build web apps that are commonly used today, at the very least, you would likely need to have experience with some JavaScript. Beyond needing to be at least familiar with JavaScript in order to create some of that functionality, it's very unlikely that you'll just use vanilla JavaScript at a company or an organization. Most have adopted frameworks like React or Angular or Vue to help build these complex web apps. So taking it one step further from JavaScript, it's very likely that they would even want you to have experience with one of these frameworks to even be considered for the role. Today's front-end developer market is steep. And I would not recommend throwing yourself into the pool without a common tool that most of, if not all, uh, candidates have at this point, which would be JavaScript. So maybe HTML and CSS alone isn't enough to land you a job, but there are still ways that you can make money with these skills. They're very marketable, and with a little bit of practice, there are all kinds of things that you can create. Thankfully, we have sites like Pinterest and Behance for some design inspo. So here are a few options for you. You can create and sell digital product templates. These can be website templates, email templates, landing pages. All of these can be created with HTML and CSS alone. One of my favorite things about web development is the opportunity to be creative with code. So not only can this be a great way to monetize those skills, but it can be a great way to build your design skills as well. Another product might be icon sets. I'm always on the hunt for cute icons to add to my personal projects. And creating and selling cool themed icon sets is a great way to make a little cash. With a little patience, you can create stunning SVGs that add life to any website. HTML and CSS are skills to be built upon. They're at the start of your journey, but you can do tons of cool things with them. So don't be discouraged and keep learning. I hope that you all found this video helpful. Don't forget to follow me on my other socials like TikTok where I typically post daily and Instagram. And until next time, I will see you all in the next video.